Very soon here, we'll be able to wander along a new, gentle, and short loop trail that features some of La Honda Creek Preserve's many treasures in just over a mile. In the winter of 2022, we got a sneak preview led by Midpen Maintenance Supervisor and expert trail builder Don Mackesy and Midpen Ranger Michael Barnes. Even if you're not a big hiker, you can still get out here, you can still get the feeling of summiting, you can still take in the views and have an experience and really get a good sense of what this preserve has to offer. It's a really unique trail out here. It gives you a little of everything in just a real short amount of time. We're really looking forward to having just about everybody be able to experience all of those uh, really special environments out here. The trail leads us over rolling grasslands and grazing areas and delivers great views of La Honda. This is terrific, wow. Before leading us into deep forests and lush vegetation. Hey, this is nice and cool and forested. What are we uh, looking at here in terms of vegetation? Uh, we've got some big dug firs here, um, uh, some oak trees. We experience a sheltered world of woodlands and wood rat nests and geological reminders of our changing coastline. This would have been uh, basically lava, essentially, close to the surface coming up when this all used to be under the ocean, under the Pacific. We round a corner and suddenly find ourselves soaking in the damp, cool air of a redwood forest and a whole new palette of plants. All right, so here we're coming up on a beautiful rare plant uh, that we have out in this preserve and several others. This is called Western Leatherwood, and we are lucky enough right now to be here when it is mm. blooming. So it's one of those unusual plants that blooms in the wintertime. Protecting plants like this leatherwood while building a trail right next to them takes careful planning. The crew did a great job of creative problem solving when they were building to try to get this area up higher but far enough out so that it wouldn't impact this plant or those nests. It's really like a five-dimensional chess thing <laughs> because you, you, have, yeah. you have so many different moves. This could harm that, that could harm, so you have to be exceedingly careful in the design and then the implementation of it. Sometime in 2022, we can all enjoy this walk through nature and time, sometimes in the company of grazing cattle. As long as we don't leave the trail and bother them, they'll give us plenty of room to appreciate the work they're doing for nature and for us. Take your time. Uh, remember to, to breathe and just take it in. If you stop and listen, there's, there's so much to, to be found and so many treasures to, to see on the landscape. When we come back, get a special behind the scenes tour of a coastal kingdom of nature and agriculture being ready to receive us in the years ahead. <laughs> 